that, we are downtown Seattle, where we very seldom come. Hi there. Sorry, I kind of shocked you there. <laughs> downtown Seattle, we never really come here, but there's things here. A lot of people seem to be out, so it's cool. We'll kind of show you some things and hope for the best. How about you? What do you think about this? I think, where can I get a coffee? Oh, of course, shocking. What's a coffee? Let's uh, cross up here. What a steep hill. <laughs> <laughs> Very steep hill here. Leading down to the Puget Sound. Pretty awesome. And um, yeah, it's called Elliott Bay, right? Elliott Bay, not Puget Sound. I think so. I think so, yeah. I don't really know. I'm so We're educated. <laughs> yes, right. We're giving you a tour. We not know not much. I think this is... That long line there is for, I believe, the first Starbucks, which is right over here. Pretty awesome. And uh, long line there, so we'll get coffee elsewhere because... And yes, here's Poroshki Place right here. They've definitely downsized a lot of their spots due to the pandemic, but it's the Russian food place that everyone loves here. Um, pretty cool, like cakes and pastries. There's a nice long line for it. And if we will get some later, we'll show you inside. But again, super long line. French bakery. Another long line. The long lines could be also um, due, in fact, to them focusing on, yeah, limiting on social distancing. So the long lines may kind of be artificial in a sense. We'll get food eventually. <laughs> We're just walking by. Oh, this is Beecher's, I believe. What is happening here? I believe they're making cheese. Yeah. Ooh, cheese curds. We actually had these cheese curds from Beecher's um, on the poutine mm. the other night. I don't know who he is. He's, uh, yeah, he's yeah, definitely, he brought the party with him. He's filming, I'm uh, not filming. He's singing a nice soprano voice he has. That's pretty awesome. Would you like a uh, hot chocolate? Sure. Hi there, how are you? I don't want to have hot chocolate. Can I get your um, 69 Getting coffee? Money, money, money. That's right. Use that card. Get that latte. And yes, it's not Starbucks, but that's okay because hey, I, I bet it's the same as it doesn't matter. Yeah, we don't need that stuff. <laughs> we'll get a sticky bun instead. <laughs> these tasty fruits oh my gosh golly look at this puppy. the this colors look at this puppy oh, puppy too i never seen a, like a puppy <laughs> we get distracted by puppies <laughs> <gasps> oh my gosh they all look so fresh and delicious this is you know kind of truly the whole i guess the like og region for this place it's like a public market where vendors come and sell their goods and sell fresh fruit, but yet we think of it as a fish market and a tourist place. But it is where people come and sell their fresh vegetables and produce, so that's pretty cool. Nice kicks, Cal. 
<laughs> so here's what everyone films. This Pike Place Market sign behind us. This is the kind of famous iconic thing that everyone films. You see it everywhere. It's on every uh, YouTube cover. Very it's touristy. Very touristy. But it's awesome. And right behind that, behind us, somewhere back there, is where they toss the fish. So we'll come do that and check it out. I believe that's where they toss the fish, where they sell fish. But as a non seafood eater, I'm not going to get any fish. That's okay. If it was tofu, I'll eat it for you. Thank you. If, uh, if they were tossing tofu, I'd eat that, but for grapes. Imagine it's tofu. Yeah. Imagine tofu. It'll be really good, right? <laughs> Salmon. More seafood, right? Uh oh. She found rocks. Rocks. Yeah, rocks, gems. Oh, they're not? Okay. Never mind. made it outside. This is awesome. The Ferris wheel is working. Yeah, no, the, so the large Ferris wheel down there, which you can see, is on. Things are on. There definitely are precautions, but this is the newer portion they added maybe a year and a half ago. <laughs> Used to be a... Uh, oh my God. Highway. Yeah, that was... um. That's demolished. Like what was that? That was the old... Um, I-99, which is now underground, but right down there, you can see it is amazing. I think they're turning it into a public park, but uh, it's pretty awesome. It's so unique, and I know that it definitely made a lot of noise. That's why it's probably pretty quiet nowadays, because that whole thing made so much noise before, and uh, now it doesn't, so. The hero of the portrait. I take family photos over here. <laughs> I should be in the mall. Glamour shots. <laughs> it's getting cold, uh, windy, but it's gorgeous though. And there's so much changing that you don't realize is changing, right? Changing. Changes are coming, see? Snowman, where? You don't see him? No. Where's your snowman at? Sasquatch. It's a snowman. That's, it's Bigfoot. Snowman. That's snowman. That's another name. No? No. Close. Tell me if I'm wrong, you guys. She, please, please tell her. Give a like in the comments, snowman right? Snowman and Sasquatch. Sno Thank you. <laughs> it's the same thing, no? Starbucks right there. So that's, a, that's the OG Starbucks right uh -huh. there, where that long line is, where... I'm not going because I don't like lines. I already got my coffee. She got her coffee. We're good there. It's Post Alley. Yay. With more restaurants, shops, and things to do. And your favorite, Natasha, European sandwiches. Oh my gosh, that bear blows bubbles. That's awesome. It's fun. Yeah. Childlike. It's hey. the bubble bear. Oh, so you can play it? Oh, and 
It's the gum wall. And it's exploded. It's more gum right now. I don't know if it's less. It gets cleaned. Mm. Wanna add some gum to the wall? If I had one. Yeah, I don't I put Adam carried really gum, chew gum since anymore. I was in like eighth grade. I always mooch it off friends too. But yes, that's the gum wall. So gum wall, it's cool. I mean it's kinda like oh whatever, to us, but Pretty chill. Get add gum, put it on the wall. Yeah. <laughs> uh, unicorn burritos. Oh, there's a thing of them right now. This is cool. Burrito unicorn. That's the world famous Pike. Nah, not Pike Place. That's the world famous uh, Showbox Theater. Um, Thief and Soul. There's issues of having it imploded or keeping the facade we'll but right now keep it keep it right there now there's no concerts going bigger one in soto area if you kind of like cross whole downtown yes yeah and that one is much bigger than this location but it's iconic in there yeah been in there it's gorgeous in there it's like this old school kind of like palace steps down columns it's a pretty cool venue in there and you know like most things over in seattle where the property and where the rent value is high that's got to go and it's not right but hopefully things will change after the pandemic big concerts the best concerts will love it